Jesse. <clears throat> I grew up believing that God has a plan for all of us. You just have to keep your eyes open and look for the signs. Well, that evening when we got together with our friends at dinner for the first time, and you sat across from me, I couldn't help but pay attention to you. Kirby Wyatt Alford, you are the best thing in my life and I could not imagine life without you. You have the kindest heart of anyone I've ever met and have the sweetest soul. I love how goofy you are. I love that you love camping and ice cream. You challenge me in ways that I need in a partner and friend. There is no doubt in my mind that you will be the best dad and I will fall even more in love with you when that time comes. I couldn't help put Pay attention to your beautiful green eyes, your soft smile, your glowing confidence. It truly gave me butterflies in my gut and it made me weak in my knees. And from then on, I, I knew right away there was something very special about you that I just couldn't let slip away. You make me feel beautiful, you make me feel worthy, and you make me feel so loved. You will never understand how badly I needed you, but God did. You have made me a better person as our love for one another is reflected in the way I live my life. You are my home, my best friend. Our love will continue to grow each and every day, and I cannot wait to see what God has in store for us as we start our lives together as one flesh. I have known Kirby and Jesse for a very long time. Growing up, you know, Kirby's family has basically been my family too. Kirby's my best friend, and you know, as long as he's been with Jesse, Jesse's been my best friend too. That being said, y'all are, he is now your best friend. You're his best friend. So take care of him, because I know you will. Cheers to the beautiful bride and groom. I knew immediately there was nothing like she'd never been so giddy she'd never been like so excited and just to tell even like my family about you and that's when I knew that you were about to steal my best friend and sister from me it really does still stand true today I like have never seen her miss someone so much when you're gone it's truly come out like as you've been gone and I I want to thank you for that I knew Jesse would always find that special guy, and uh, Kirby, you're that you're that guy. You're that you're that guy, man. I promise to love you every single day, unconditionally. I promise to honor you, I promise to support you, encourage you, and I promise to let you do the same for me. I promise to always go on adventures with you and be your best friend forever. I promise to always dream with you, laugh with you, respect you, and cry with you until my last breath. I promise to listen to you and solve problems together. When we disagree, I promise to always compromise with you. You will never have to go to bed not knowing that you're loved. All right, I love you too. Bye. I'll see you soon. 
I promise to always put Jesus first and let him lead our family. I will love you unconditionally when we are together and when we are apart. I take you to be my partner for life. I promise above all else to live in truth with you and to keep making fun of each other until we are old and wrinkled. <laughs> I promise to be your strength when you are weak. I promise to be your shoulder to cry on. Jessica Charlotte June Bennett, I love you with all my heart. And I promise to give you all of my heart until my last breath. I am honored, blessed, and overwhelmed with joy to become your wife. I love you. Love you too. Since they've made these commitments before God in this assembly, by the authority of God and the laws of this state, I declare that Kirby and Jesse are now husband and wife. Kirby, you can kiss your wife. And you will be cold, sunny, oh my, but sunny, oh my.